Welcome back, me hearties. Can all members of the Two Cap crew grab a bucket? I think we've sprung a leak. Fingers crossed, we can plug the hole and get back on track with some swashbuckling finds. Let's call upon Rich H this week. Rich normally eats star finds for breakfast on his channel. He churns out coin hunts like hot dinners. So if you're coin hungry, go and check out his channel. Will we strike it rich this hunt? Will I be a rich man fiddling on the roof? All day long fiddling with my coins. The coins this week. Sealed bags. Dated 5th of February. Twenty-five, all present and correct. I stand corrected. There are one or two that aren't sealed. Most of them are very unusual, but it has been seen before. For the book, you might ask. I'll quickly do this. For the treasure chest, we just need a long wait in the Kew Gardens. The sea swept swimmer, the aquatic forced to abandon ship. An athletic swashbuckling sea worm, high jumping like a fish out of water. Row, row, row your boat gently on this stream. And other than that, it's just the latest one. The catch of the day, the salmon, the freshest meat out there. So it's getting tricky. We're calling upon Rich H. For richer or for poorer, what will it be? What will be our first doubloon of the hunt? Well, our first doubloon of the hunt is Paddy at the tower. Come and find. Oh. We have an unsealed bag. Will it make any difference? Presumably the bank have just made up the numbers. Who knows? We have a sea swept swimmer, but it's not the one we want. So close, but yet so far. Team GB. It's a nice coin. Suffers from high mintage, still classed as face value. So, 50 pence, none the richer. Averaging a commemorative a bag so far. Are there going to be any riches? Are there going to be any spoils? I think we have something there. Just spying the edge of it. We are cloud bursting like the sun's coming out, like your sun's coming out. Five million mintage. I won't put it in the swash book last, like last week. I would have just end up demoting it to this mid range section. Still, it isn't a terrible find though. We have a pug. Dirty old coin. Dirty old coin. Yeah, I was serious, Gavin. I was going to do a dirty deer to run a bit like RJ, but just with the definitives. And then I'd probably throw them back into the wild, to be honest. I won't be keeping them. Don't panic. I can see you had a sweat on. It's not for me either, really, to be honest. Can't afford to be keeping all of those nasty coins. Look at that. That is a nasty coin, but it actually looks like it's brought the Battle of Britain to life, doesn't it? Outstanding. Let's hope this is the GSC. It is. Wouldn't have fancied an IRB. 
going in that state. I quite like that. I'm not sure where it's been. But we don't need it for the book. That would have been a spoiled rich, wouldn't it? Not the riches or spoils are meant, but we carry on. Come on, Rich Itch. Where's that look of yours? One peat makes you richer, but one tail makes you small. Unfortunately, the Peter Rabbits from 2017 are all highly minted, will not make you rich. Ask any of them. Go ask Thomas. Go ask Jeremy. It's one of my favourite songs of all time, that one. Just had to get it out there. Yes, if you go chasing rabbits, I suggest the 2018 Peter Rabbit for lower mintage, not the 17th. That is a good condition to the well, 2005. It's not terrible. It's worth 50 pence. Come on. Need more riches. Ah! It's a half pound of the Baskervilles. 50 pence Sherlock. Highly minted though. Still. Churning some out slowly but surely. Are we going to go from rags to riches? Come on, Rich. 2017. Mr. Jeremy Fisher is from the 2017 series. It's in fine condition. But it's worth 50 pence. It's not a swashbuckler. We're getting there. Pride. A deeper love. Whoa, 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 whoa. Twenty twenty. Starting to see these quite regularly now. Ooh. We have a commemorative. It may not be a swashbuckler. But we now have KC and the Sunshine Band. Miggy Almy Run, Almy Run, Miggy Almy Run. It is, of course, the Queen's Memorial. Memories are made of this. We don't need it for the book. It's the Salmon Rushdie we need. Dirty old coin. See another one on the horizon after this one. And a new rain will begin. It's the memories of the Queen Elizabeth II strike two. It's one for the dirty date run. What did uh, Shakey's Coins call it the other day? I think he was doing a £2 dirty one. The whole, oh, it was a fake. It's the whole, Hall of Shame, I think he called it. Very good. And baby, you're a rich man. This is as good as it's got so far. We have a platy jubes. Celebrating the Queen's Jubilee. And there were five, just over 5 million of those. 5 million and 70. 70 relating to the 70th, of course. I'll put it as a swashbuckler because I prefer this one to that one. And there's still a mystery around that. I'm keeping them. Just to make sure there are actually 7 million of them. Because I don't believe what they say. See what you like. 
No harm in holding on to them for a while till the dust settles. Oh, I didn't even clock it was an 11. We have a Dalek. Exterminate. Or as Bungle would call it, Goodminton, because there's no such thing as a bad Olympic. Love that phrase. We have a swashbuckler. Yeah. It's not needed for the book. Is it needed for... The sports edition change check our album. I'm just gonna double check. Oh, it's not. I don't need many for that. I always forget I've got that to fill. Swashbuckler nonetheless. Get in. Well done, Rich. From rags to riches. All I thought we were gonna have was rich tea biscuits dunked in the coffee with bits falling off. But no. The main man has delivered another dirty old coin. 2008 Britannia. It is eight, isn't it? Not three. No, it's a three. It's a red herring. Keep them coming. Keep them coming. That's better, Rich. There's a few in here. 5.9 million mintage. It's one of the better paddies. Second best paddy, I would say, after the station. It's Paddy with his flag at Buckingham Palace. Excellent. Twenty twenty. That's probably about ten. Oh my dears! Done it again. Two thousand eleven. Modern pentathlon. Wowzers! Now, do I need this one? Modern pentathlon. I need aquatics, athletics, cycling, hockey, rowing. Shooting, wheelchair rugby. I don't need, don't need it. I don't even need many to be fair. I've even had it as a duplicate in this album. Can you believe it? It's getting hard now, peeps, to find one for the book. Not going to be much book love for a while, I'm afraid. What am I on? Episode forty-six. I feel like these duplicates could have been going into a book. I said recently I might. In one of the comments, who was that to M Collects possibly? That I might trigger Article 50. What do you reckon, guys? Have a second book starting at, on the 50th hunt. Because these are becoming hard to find. And I'm probably going to be on this book trying to fill it for years. So I think a second one should run alongside it in about three or four hunts time. Makes sense to me anyway. Is that a two? Oh, it's a 2003 looking like an eight. Yep. Victoria Cross, the medals. Not the re-released version. Nice to see. Don't see it very often. And we have the undated Charles. So that must be memories are made of this. It certainly is. And once again, back is the incredible. And his new reign shall begin. But for how long, we wonder. Slightly morbid thoughts, we'll not talk over there. Keep it up, Rich, you're doing well. Oh. First outing for one of the two recent duds. The Crystal Maze. Du, 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 du. The 2020 Diversely Built Britain. It's common as muck. Speaking of muck. Dirty old coin. Dirty old coin. 
Here's as me when you put the dirty ones out, how many you actually get in a hunt. No, I think it's as many as that. Let me put that one over there. Seventeen. It's Benjamin Bunny. Are we going to be part of Master T's Rotary Club? Nope. But we will sign it and release it into the wild with the two cap skull and crossbones logo for you lot to find and add to your collection. Should you desire. We have a Jolly Roger over the banister. Old sexy legs. Not the re-released version. It's 2004. It's worth 50 pence. Still. Good to see a commemorative out and about. Stretching its legs. We did well with the 2006 and seven last week. I've just seen an absolute cracker. Suffragette City and David Bowie. It is. Give women the vote. Suffragettes. Get in. It's another swashbuckler. I'll take that. Still not needed for the book. We don't have anything for the book. But we have a good hand. We have a rich hand. All day long I've fiddled with me coin because I've become a rich man. Thank you, Rich H. The look that man has is unbelievable. And it is rubbing off. Create the space like John Bonds. Dirty old coin. Dirty old coins from the year 2000. Ugh. How did it get in that state? Treasure from the bottom of the ocean. University built Britain once again, 2020. Sunshine on a rainy day. Metal strike two. Another one of those tinny sounding ones. Keep half a dozen of those just because I can. Three unsealed. Let's get rid of these ones first. Benjamin Bunny, non-rotary. Well, we certainly are in a rich vein of form. To cap your rich man now. Well, not quite, but you know what I mean. It's a dirty dictionary. Turn up for the books. Seventeen. We have a shield. Another low mintage. I think there's only one point eight million of those. That is ridiculous when you think about it. Rather shiny two thousand and four. Got the date run material. Did well last week with the date run, didn't I? Very well. I wonder how many I've let go. I don't, you know, don't normally scrutinise them at this point. It's hard in this light to see. Is that 2004 in good nick? I have no idea. See what I mean? I don't have a date run out in front of us to compare and contrast. 
Whether you see them or you don't, that's the way it is. We have another pug. Dirty old coin. Dirty old coin. What a disgrace. Memories every day on the coin map. Wow, this date run isn't going to take long to complete. A 2019 filthy one. It's been keeled, hauled, nibbled by the sharks. You name it. Cat and nine tails. It's a, a richly deserved hunt, I would say. One peat makes you richer, but this one makes you small. Twenty twenty in bad condition. Oof, diversity. What? We have the heroic axe with, is it an X somebody's posted? Oh, I'm not really sure. All I know is it's 2006, it's not a re-release, so I'm not going to worry about it too much. 2020 shield. It's five already, they really are coming out now. It takes a while to hit the northeast. Can we add another to make it a trio of Olympics, Rich? Come on. Oh, I'm more likely to get another dozen dirties. Of course, it wouldn't be a hunt without a break shirt. Another 2020, half a dozen of those. Who needs a count on the top corner when you can just add them up yourself, eh? Oh, dirty old coin. Another 2,000. The aftermath of partying like it's 1999. The clean-up. Oh, my dears. Turn the page. Bring the coin! It's public libraries. It's like, sort of, oddly clean at the bottom. Wow. Doing really well for the selection of coins on the mat. Very diverse, shall we say. A 2008. Wouldn't be a hunt without one of those to swashbuckler. Low budget one. Party at the palace again. See the Chris Packard error. I think it is. It's the Scouts, not the re-release version. Be prepared for when you might get a re-release. It's worth a lot more than 50 pence. Always worth checking. Strike seven on the 2020s. Strike three on the Diversity Built Britain. No, oh, strike four. Beg your pardon. That's bad. Any more riches? Any more spoils? Can we strike it rich one more time? It's a dirty dictionary. And that is your whack. So, 
I'm now on lookout duty from the crow's nest for any low mintage years or NUFCs amongst the definitives I might have missed. And I shall report back. I know. Sadly, no NUFCs. Just another couple of SAFCs. Soiled, adulterated, filthier coins. Making up a second dirty dozen in just two hunts. Shaky's coins puts his in a wall of shame. So I literally need to coin a phrase of my own. How about the scum run? The Brit shit house, The book of poop? The file of bile? Or my personal favourite, the wrap of crap. Here is the wrap of crap, already partially soiled from last hunt. Tune in to the next 10p hunt for an update on whether we can fill the crap gaps. So, we've gone from bags to riches, thanks to some rich H look. If I were a rich H, yabba dibby 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 dum. All day long I'd fiddle with me coin if I were a wealthy man. Six swash bucklers including two olympics in the form of modern pentathlon and badminton worth up to three pound each two definitives and a jubilant scene probably worth a quid each but my personal favorite goes to this pristine 100th anniversary of women's social and political union the suffragette lady with a banner chained to the railing by mary milner dickens circulated it's worth three pound however according to the books uncirculated 15 to 25 pound Why is that, you might ask? According to this book, I'll give you... So, as new, 20 quid. Increased value recently due to someone discovering 13 years later that 3.1 million mintage is on the low side compared to most other 50p coins. Whatever the case, it's a priceless moment in history for women. 3.1 million minted. It's in beautiful condition. Rich H is a rich man. Two cap is a rich man too. We get all our money from a Bitcoin bag videoed for you. What a thing to do. Please like, sub, comment. It's free.